Number 41, nitrogen and oxygen react at high temperatures. And then we have letter D, what will happen to the concentrations of N2O2 and NO at equilibrium if NO is added? Okay, so we're still talking about concentrations, manipulating the concentrations of a substance to see what's going to happen at equilibrium, Le Chatelier's principle. So in order for this even to change the system, NO has to be a gas or aqueous. And I look here, this is a gas, so it's going to run by Le Chatelier's principles, and they're all gases, so they're all going to be affected. Now I come down here. This is the information that we need to know. If you increase an amount of something, in this case we're adding NO, so I will put a arrow here, I'm increasing NO, you have way too much, right? You have over the equilibrium limit. So you want to get rid of it. You always want to counteract what you did. So if that's the case, you always shift to the opposite side. So if you have too much of this, you don't want to go and make more. You need to bring it back down to, you know, have equilibrium happen. So you're going to shift to the other side. And then if this is the shift that's happening, get rid of this uh, arrow because now this is what's going to happen at equilibrium. These reactants are going to increase because we're going that way. And this will now decrease. And that's exactly what we wanted. So N2 will increase, O2 will increase, and NO will drop. And there's your answers. Concentration of N2 will increase. Concentration of O2 will also increase because they're both reactants. And then the concentration of NO would decrease because that's what set off this whole change. You had to bring it back down. And there are your three answers. Pretty simple, guys. What do you think? Hopefully this is helping. The Chatelier's could be a little bit, uh, you know, not irritating at first, but it could be a, a difficult concept for some students, but I know you guys got it. Just remember your rules and you should be good, okay? And don't be afraid to draw out your arrows on the test or quiz, all right? Anything that will help you, you know, go get, you know, do it, right? So thank you so much, and I will see you in the next part, okay? Bye-bye.